Leonard, I've got terrible news. What's going on? Before I tell you, perhaps I should soften the blow. Your face is pleasingly symmetrical. <laughs> Just tell me. A Swedish team of physicists is trying to scoop our superfluid vortex experiment. That kind of stinks. That kind of stinks. But why aren't you more upset? Did I soften the blow too much? Yeah, because <laughs> this here is more like a Picasso painting. What are we gonna do? Perform the experiment immediately. Well, I'd love to, but we need liquid helium and our shipment's on back order for a month. A month? Well, are you kidding me? That'd have been a good time for you to soften the blow. <laughs> That shirt brings out the blue in your eyes. Thank you, aren't you sweet? Let's go check to see if the university has any helium in reserve. Did you know that I almost didn't wear this shirt today? <laughs> hey, Barry, we're in trouble. We need liquid helium. Does the department have any we can use? Sorry, there's a shortage in what we do have I need for my quantum excitation study. But you won't need much for that. True, but if it's successful, I'm having a party with balloons. <laughs> Come on, uh, Barry, there's a Swedish team trying to run our experiment before us. Can you spare any? Be honest. If the shoe was on the other foot, would you do this for me? Yes. Not a chance. <laughs> what are you doing? He said be honest, so I was honest. Didn't your mother tell you? It's the best policy. <laughs> so, what do you say? Hell no. <laughs> he could have softened the blow.